In November 2010, the USGS Arizona Water Science Center conducted a seepage investigation on Clear Creek, Chevlon Creek, and a reach of the Little Colorado River on the Colorado Plateau in northeastern Arizona. Clear and Chevlon Creeks are tributaries to the Little Colorado River. The study, funded by the Bureau of Indian Affairs, will provide baseline information about groundwater discharge from the Sea Aquifer, the largest aquifer system in northeast Arizona. As when you see, there'll be a series of springs through this area. Kurt, you've been here before, right? Yeah. And so the question is how we're going to. The term base flow describes stream flow that results from groundwater discharging to the river from the aquifer. The stream flow seen here during the time of this seepage investigation was entirely base flow from groundwater discharging from the Coconino Sandstone, one of the primary geologic units of the sea aquifer. The Coconino Sandstone is the tanned sedimentary rock outcropping in the background. Would you go uh, every two tenths on this thing? What's the total? It looks like it's about... We're grooming a measuring section right now for the discharge measurement. And although it's not an ideal section, it's pretty much all we have to work with in this reach. And this is right where Clear Creek as a stream enters into the reservoir. And so we need to constrict the water just to come through this little opening right here so that we can measure the discharge of the stream as it goes into the reservoir. A seepage investigation involves the measurement of base flow at multiple locations along a stream in as short a time as possible. The intent is to develop a detailed snapshot regarding the locations and amounts of water that enter and leave a stream along its length. Such information is required to understand the stream's water budget and to determine where a stream is connected to its underlying aquifer. Over time, as groundwater is developed for public or municipal supply, or as climate changes, or both, the amount of base flow entering and leaving the stream is likely to change due to stresses imposed on the aquifer system. This base flow investigation will give us information for one point in time that we can compare against previous and future seepage investigations. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm making a uh, stream flow discharge measurement across the Little Colorado River below the confluence of the uh, of Clear Creek, and uh, I'm uh, measuring about 30 sections across, trying to get a representative flow, try shooting to get 5% uh, or less in each section. I'm measuring the um, parameters for the water for pH, specific conductance, temperature, dissolved oxygen. Along with the seepage measurements, these water quality field parameters are used to help us determine the sources and pathways of water, and to help USGS scientists better understand the hydrologic system of the sea aquifer.